Look up into a clear blue sky. Look as far as you can. Look into distance itself. What do you see? Endless blue, the color of heaven. In Hebrew, there's a specific name for that color. It's called Techeles or Techelet. Techelet is the color of infinite distance. There's another word in Hebrew which is spelled almost identically to Techelet. The word is Tachlit or Tachlis, which means the end or the purpose. Techelet is the end of sight of all perception and also its purpose to see to the end. Jews have a mitzvah, a commandment, when wearing a four-cornered garment to attach four threads to each of its four corners. The four corners of that garment represent the four corners of the world, the four cardinal points of the compass, and the threads attached to them are called tzitzis or tzitzit. The tzitzit extend out of the four corners of the garment, and the tzitzit extend our view beyond this four-cornered world. Historically, one of the threads of the tzitzit is blue, tchelet, and the other three, white. White is the beginning of all color. If you take the three primary colors, green, blue, and red, and combine them together, you'll get white. White is the beginning of all color, and tchelet is the end of color, the blue beyond. The word tzitzit comes from the same root as lahatzit, which means to peak. Tzitzit allow us a peak beyond this world. The Gemara in Menachot says, when we look at the blue of the tzitzit, we see a reflection of the blue of the sea. And the blue of the sea is a reflection of the blue of the sky. And the blue of the sky is a reflection of the kisei hakavod, the throne of glory a mystical concept which represents the infinity of God himself, the Ein Sof, that which is without end. What is the connection of the blue of the tzitzit to the blue of the sea and the blue of the sky and the blue of the kisei kavod? They are all without end. Left to itself, the sea would engulf the land many times. It is without end. The prophet Yirmiyahu Jeremiah says that Hashem made the sand as an everlasting boundary to the sea. Though its waves toss, they cannot prevail. Though they roar, they cannot pass. Meaning that in its essence, the sea is really without end and it's just held back by the sand. And the sea is a reflection of the sky, the blue beyond endless distance. And the Kisi Akovod is by definition that which is without end, the Ein Sof. With a few threads, we can take a peek beyond our little four-cornered world and connect to infinity. <laughs>